Hello, welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are doing an amazing well time, an amazing time. I hope you guys are doing good in all of these shifts that are happening on Earth right now. So a lot of you may know that I do tarot readings. I do have an announcement to make here as I've kind of backed off on doing the tarot readings. It's not that it wasn't working, it got me up to 1500 subscribers and I am eternally grateful for all of you who have subscribed and who watch and who continue to watch my tarot readings but i have made a decision that i'm not going to be doing 12 signs a week it's just way too much for me and <clears throat> to give you a little backstory maybe a couple weeks ago my partner and i took a trip to the mountains up in mount st helens it was beautiful i'm going to make a video about it put all of the pictures, all the videos that we took in a video so that you guys could see what we experienced. Um, but when we returned, it feels like we both kind of stepped into a new chapter in our lives, right? Um, so what we have decided to do is transform our current property into a, a large-ish scale um, gardening process or gardening gardening project right and in august in late july we're going to be selling to the farmers markets right um i don't currently have enough time nor energy to put both things together i can't do 12 readings a week and do the process outside, right? So what I plan to do is transform this channel a tiny bit and show the process of turning our property into a garden. But also I will continue to do one tarot reading a week for the collective, as I have always said in my readings that I feel more connected to the collective itself. I feel the energy on earth more so than I feel individual signs. I try to um, connect to the signs um, individually, but it kind of drained my energy a lot because I was forcing it. I could connect no problem, but I was forcing and forcing and forcing readings out to try to just uh, get myself out there, you know, and I don't want to do that anymore. I want to make videos for myself and the collective, but mainly myself, you know, I, I do find fun and passion in video making and filmography and just slapping together some videos and posting it, you know, um, but I don't want to take it so seriously. We don't have to take things so seriously in life. And, and what I have been shown is that I'm not just a tarot reader. You know, I have other aspects to me. I have other interests in my life, like gardening, like landscaping, like leatherworking. I even want to start uh, posting my leatherworking videos and stuff like that. And I don't want this channel to be solely focused on, you know, tarot reading. It was fun and it was good and it brought my subscriber count up phenomenally um, something that surprised the heck out of me you know but I do want to take a step back here and post my gardening videos and then give a general um, generalized collective reading each week maybe Monday I'll post it Monday you know and I will do next week's reading tomorrow but yeah, so don't be mad at me if I don't do your science reading. I'm just kind of taking a step back and, you know, just doing my own thing here. I will still be making videos and still be posting the process of things and still be doing a tarot reading. Just not so much of them, you know. And I still offer personal readings. <clears throat> if you come up to me and say, hey, um, something is happening in my life, my... Um, you know, I need some guidance, no problem. I will do a personal reading for you. I have no problem connecting like that. But just taking on so many readings a week, I, I just don't have time nor the energy for. But if you need help, I'm here, man. Like, 
The links are still in the description. I will keep them in the description to go ahead and, and book yourself a personal reading. I mean, here, let's do one, do a little bit right now. I have a deck with me. So for the collective, for this next week, I will actually do a tarot reading for next week. Just... But this is a spirit animal deck. So, see, I, see, I do miss doing these. I've kind of even halted um, doing them for myself, too. And I want to get back to it, you know? I want to make it a, a better practice. I feel like I've been just so focused on my outside world that I kind of have been ne neglecting my spiritual side, too. So I want to get back into, you know, more journaling, meditating, um, tarot reading, divination of all sorts. I mean, I have a rune right here. I do make runes too, so if, if you're interested in a rune set by me, uh, go ahead and shoot me an email. What is the spirit animal of next week for the general collective? All right, tiger. We have the spirit animal of tiger. Let's see what it says. I choose to be unstoppable. My passion is my power. I am bold, I am brave. Mighty forces come to my aid. So we have a whole bunch of fire energy coming in next week. Use that. Use that to your advantage. I already feel feel the fire inside myself growing. So let it grow inside of you too. Anyway, that's my announcement for uh, today. If this is just a spontaneous. I, I've been wanting to make this for a couple days now. Um, I just didn't know how to go about doing it, and the spirit told me that I need to do it right now. No, no script, no, no nothing like that. Don't think about it, just let it flow out of you. And I am here to tell you that you don't have to be so singular. Like, if you're a carpenter, you don't have to only be a carpenter. If you're a tarot reader, you don't have to only be a tarot reader. You can have other aspects to yourself. We're multifaceted here in this life. We have other interests. We have other passions. So use that to your advantage and show the world that you don't have to be so cut and dry. You are this. You are that. You are everything. You are what you choose to be in any moment. Like right now, I just did a somewhat terror reading, a divination of sorts. But in like five minutes, I'm going to go out and shoot a time lapse of me putting soil in the yard. I am multifaceted and you can be too. Anyway, I love you. I still see you. And I am still with you forever and always. Bye, guys.